So today I wanted to just kind of address a few things that I'm noticing when I'm losing weight. And one of them is my, of course, I have some extra skin or fat here that needs to still go away, but I'm noticing, and I've noticed in some of my other videos, that my neck is, it, it looks more wrinkly since I've lost a little bit of weight. So I'm just making this quick and easy. Um, also, my eyes, I think, they used to be super puffy. They still are. But they're starting to thin out a little bit, so I hope that that goes away. So today I just wanted to touch base and I wanted to get your input on what are you guys, if you're losing weight with, um, you know, your weight loss, what are you doing if you're noticing these things? And let me know if you guys are noticing any of this and what you're doing. I would love to hear from you because, you know, losing weight is a process. This, I hope, goes away. This little guy here, I'm hoping as I continue to lose weight that I'm going away. I am right here with my breakfast and I am having eggs with cheese. Hmm. So I scrambled three eggs and I put avocado with Himalayan sea salt. So I am grabbing uh, eggs, Himalayan sea salt, cheese, cheddar cheese, and whipped cream. Yummy. Yummy, yummy. But So what you guys are doing and what you are... Uh, what you're noticing with your weight loss, if you are losing weight, how much weight you've lost. So I'd love to hear from you guys. Another thing I've noticed is my skin. My skin has always been very dry because of my thyroid issue. So my skin actually, if you can believe it, it still looks really dry. But my skin is starting to look a little bit uh, softer, not so dry. And I did see... I'm going to try this and I'll let you know how it works, but I'm going to try to add some coconut oil, like two tablespoons of coconut oil to one teaspoon of baking soda. I have heard that that takes away the lines in the face and I'm going to also put it on my neck. That's going to be what I try, but I want to hear what you guys uh, try. So I'm going to be really good and... We'll see what happens this week. I'm going to do just, I'm going to try to stay with just salads and veggies. You guys know that I do the intermittent fasting. So to this week, I'm going to just try to stick with two meals and try not to do very many snacks. Trying to stay away from the keto bread and just really going back to basics. I've been taking a lot of magnesium and potassium and, of course, my Himalayan sea salts to get rid of some of my leg cramps that I've been having. So, we'll see if I can kick this keto in the butt. And we'll see if my solution that I've been told will help with this, getting rid of this, and make my face a so we'll see how being strict, a little bit more strict, because I, you know, there's a lot of, obviously, you know, I make some cooking, a lot of snacks and things like that, fat bombs. And this, this week I'm going to try something different. I'm just going to be real, uh, real tight on some of the things that I do, just make sure I get, I'm um, checking, make sure I get exactly the right amount of proteins, exactly the right amount of my net carbs and exactly the amount of fats that I need because I think I've been a little shy on my fats. I think I've been a little shy on my proteins as well. So that could very well be why I'm not losing any weight. So, you know, the way I feel is don't give up. Don't be upset. This is a lifestyle. Just if it's not working for you, do more research and try to check things out and see what happens. So that's what I'm so I'm going to do that, guys. I'm going to just...
check it out. Uh, I, I did the long version, so you guys aren't going to be able to see as wide this this one. But I wanted to really, um, <clears throat> I really wanted to focus on my neck. That's what I'm really gravitating toward. I see some differences. It's loosening up. So I'm going to do that wash that I just told you about. And we'll see what happens. I love all you guys. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. If you're having any struggles with keto or low fat or whatever you're doing, if you have any challenges that you're seeing that you're not liking, you know what? Just leave a comment below. We're all dealing with it. But don't give up. Keep going. I love each and every one of you guys. Until next time, I'll see you on my next video.